All right, hi everybody, John Meadows here, and today we're doing another exercise index video. We just finished training chest, and the last exercise we did was a pullover for our chest. Now, normally we do these for our, our uh, upper lats, teres, kind of all that muscle. And normally when we do these, we get a really nice stretch at the bottom. We only come up to the ball of our forehead so that we really keep tension in that area. But when you're training your chest on these, or when you're actually adding chest in with those muscles, your form changes a little bit. So, you know, people ask me, are pullovers for your chest, for your lats? Well, it depends on the form that you're using. So you can't just take your lats out of it. They're always gonna work. But you can make your chest do a little bit more work. Your chest absolutely contracts this way too. So we've got a little decline set up here. Honestly, I think this would probably be better with an even steeper decline, but you guys get the idea. So. What I'm gonna do now, instead of stopping at my forehead, I'm gonna come down a little further. So I'll talk you through it as I'm doing it. Okay, Brett, right on my chest. So, so normally I would come up, and I come up to about right here for lats, but I'm, I'm gonna come up further right here and see the flex on my chest. The other little thing I'm doing is I'm doing this with the dumbbell, look. So I'm going like that. And now I'm pulling with my chest as hard as I can, I'm contracting. So lats and then chest. You'll feel your lats right here and then chest. So all the way over here. If you come too far, you'll lose the tension in your chest. So there's a sweet spot that you'll find. So right here, chest. Notice I got a slight bend in my elbow and it's locked so one thing I, I do see people do a lot of is turn this into a tricep exercise so a little bend and lock now all the pulling is with my lats and my chest right there <clears throat> oh that was an ugly dismount so anyways um That'll get you your upper lats and your chest. Um, normally I do these third or fourth uh, in the chest um, sequence. I wouldn't start with these, but, um, and I normally do anywhere from eight to 12 reps. So you want probably three sets of eight to 12 here. Uh, great exercise, but we're just wrapping up our chest workout today. I wanted to share that with you. 